Are you wondering what diet you should be following in order to help you get pregnant? Nicole from Dallas, Texas is. She wrote in, Dear Fertility Godmother, I'm trying to figure out what diet I'm supposed to follow to help me get pregnant. When I look it up online, it's so confusing and I feel like I can't eat anything. What do you suggest? Well, Nicole, this is a loaded question. So come on, let's go. And welcome to the Fertility Godmother Show. Hi, I'm Denise Noyer Erez. I'm your host and I'm your fertility godmother. And I help women all around the world get pregnant, stay pregnant, and have a healthy baby. So the one thing about diet is there's not a one size fits all. So that may not be what you want to hear, but that is the truth. It's so important for you to figure out what foods are going to be good for you. So that being said, one of the keys is making sure that we're choosing foods that nourish our body. But telling you that you should follow a paleo diet or a Mediterranean diet or a vegan diet or a ketogenic diet or a gluten-free diet. There's so many different diets. I can't really give you that distinction. I can give you generalities unless I was working with you and I really understood your situation. But this is the thing. You want to pay attention to how foods feel when you're eating them. Are you nourishing your body? We want to make sure that you're choosing the right foods that feel good for you and that you're nourishing your body properly, making sure that you're getting a balanced diet with a lot of nutrients. But the one thing I know I can recommend for everybody across the board, especially when you're trying to get pregnant, and that is making sure that you're eating at least eight to 10 servings of vegetables a day. And that means having a rainbow of vegetables every single day. So you wanna have eight to 10 servings, and a serving is a half a cup cooked, or a whole cup raw of vegetables every single day. So that may sound like a lot. You may be going, oh my gosh, how am I supposed to eat eight to 10 servings of vegetables a day? I'm only eating barely two servings of vegetables a day right now. Well, that is a great place to start because now you have a goal. You can work yourself up to adding a vegetable every week adding an additional vegetable into your daily routine and start to really like them and if you don't like them you can always find a high quality supplement to help you get your vegetables in i highly recommend that you eat them though because then you're going to be getting the fiber which is really important for egg quality it's also important to help you detoxify and so many different things the fiber is good for so let me know what your favorite vegetable is and which one you're going to be adding into your diet on a regular basis don't get overwhelmed start slow just add one extra vegetable in a day and every week add in another one till you get to your goal so i hope you found this episode helpful today if you did make sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe so you don't miss next week's episode if you want more help with diets and foods that you should be including into your daily routines click the link below and get the fertility godmother's ultimate fertility diet and if you want more support click the link and sign up for a free clarity session until next time, I'm Denise Noyer-Arez, wishing you a healthy, happy pregnancy.